Why am I? Oh. Hey! <laughs> Guys, I know it's been a minute. Also, my background. Hold on. Let's get my wallpaper up and running. Um, I know it's been a minute since I posted, but oh my gosh. Flashbang. I took everything down. I stripped all the posters, guys. I stripped all the posters, got my hair done, getting my lineup tomorrow. I stripped all the posters. I took down all the trophies, all the shit, guys. Oh my gosh, we're back in the back rooms. Yes, oh my God, that's what's been happening. Yes, we're back in the back rooms. Okay, um, uh, let's, uh, the first thing I wanted to check out is the Invincible, the new Invincible season three trailer just dropped. Oh my gosh, number one trending. Who is the hottest in Invincible? Omni-Man, Alan Mahler twins, Mark. I'm not gonna lie, the voting is definitely right uh, because it's for show Omni Man. It's for show Omni Man. <sighs> whoa, whoa, hey! Uh, we have these things called doors that normal people use all the time. You should try them. We also have these things called Viltrumites. You should try winning a fight against them sometime. Okay, too, too soon, Cecil. Also, how much does it cost every time you, like, teleport? Isn't that taxpayer money? Do you know the gross economic output of Liechtenstein? Not even a little. More than that. Uh, okay, well, that seems really irresponsible. It's been months, Mark. Months since 2,000 retirees got their vacation crews ruined, and you got your ass kicked by some second cousin of your dad's who dropped in to prove a point. Hey. That point being that she could kick your ass without breaking a sweat. That's not nice. Not only that, <laughs> she promised Mr. Ten Times Worse was on his way. So what exactly have you been doing to prepare? Mm. There's only 8 billion people counting on you. I, I, I've been busy. Busy doing what exactly? Well, I, I've been busy writing, designing, storyboarding, voice acting, key posing. Hey, 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 uh, no, uh, no, 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 stop. I'm not falling for that shit. Who do you think I am? Some pickle-hating one-eyed rube from planet just what like... What is he, Deadpool? Viltrumites win? I don't think that. What? Mm. No, I bet you don't. And don't even get me started on your little four-month vacation right in the middle of things. We all sure love that. You have some mayonnaise? Okay, it was more like three uh, and a half. This is life or death, Mark. <clears throat> People are counting on you to live up to your obligations. So what exactly are you doing to get ready for what's coming? I'm, uh, you know, I, I'm... Uh, stuff. Yeah, that's what I was worried about. And why I shouldn't leave a 19-year-old in charge of Earth's security. <laughs> All right, we're taking over your training. Training? What training? What training? Okay, how about weightlifting, cardio, speed, damage resistance, flexibility, battle tactics, reaction, and punctuality. That's so much stuff. Okay, when is, when is this all going to start? <sighs> I thought you'd never ask. Come on. We're a top secret organization, Mark, and we learn from our mistakes. Well, I need to know when to show up. <sighs> Fine. Lights. Ah, much better. Still can't believe I have to exercise. Oh my God. Say less. Oh my gosh. I'm in there, bruh. I'm in there. Wait, what's this? No mid-season break. Oh, my gosh. So, they're dropping the whole... Oh, my God. Thank you. I was getting sick of that. And I was hoping more shows wouldn't start doing that. Like, dropping some episodes, taking a break, and then, you know, drop it again. Stranger Things... Tr yeah, that's just not happening because it's not on my homepage. I already knew. Good this job. Is the best burrito. Oh, my God. You're so corny, dude. You're so corny. You monkey. The monkey. Yeah, that's what I meant to say because that's the trailer for it that I'm checking out now. For the longest time. I said the monkey trailer. There was nothing. But then it appeared. Are you the trailer? First time message. I know this ain't you. I know this ain't you. Because I know you're a little boy. I know it's a little boy, bruh. A beast not from this earth. Smiting the ones who deserved it. The ones who didn't. And everyone in between. Idiot. Whoever controls it. 
controls life and death. And those deaths are really fucked up. Holy sh! This baby. Everybody dies. And that's life. It's a goddamn mess in there. Have you been up there? It's like that restaurant. Spaghetti City. Everything okay up there? Yeah, everything's fine. Okay, so I'm not gonna lie. This is a very good trailer, though. Like, the trailer was actually fire. Um, I just don't know what is going on. Like, is the monkey is the monkey supposed to be like Annabelle? Where it just is the monkey's doing bad stuff? Or is the monkey bad luck? To where if you are in possession of the monkey, bad luckish things happen to you. Like, that's kind of where, that's kind of where I'm at right now. First look at Superman and Crypto and James Gunn Superman. Wait, wait, wait. Is this the same, is this the same Superman that was, uh, where I had the poster with him putting on his boots and people were bitching about it? Oh, so the monkey is bad luck. Okay. So, okay, so now it's with the dog. Now the dog's in it. And now suddenly it's like everybody's like best comic book ever or best movie ever. looks cheap as hell i mean to, well why isn't it like high quality maybe it's just the like the picture that they got but um god can we wait for like a trailer man <laughs> can we wait for like a trailer <laughs> it looks ass like the pictures ain't really doing it justice like these look like fan made posters right now they look like fan made posters okay i will admit that just drop a trailer first before we let's look at the trailer before we give our constructive criticism man because right now the most constructive criticism i can give is that i ain't gonna lie these these uh posters look ass like they look ass live action until dawn movie will release april 25th wait in theater so we get a remake of the game so they remake the game to make it more clear and then they're gonna drop the movie a year later like why not if you go and remake it why not drop it around the same time like i feel like that would kind of make more sense but like maybe i don't know maybe marketing wise i don't know what the hell i'm talking about bro it's just like how are you going to drop the game now and then the movie comes out again like late next year i'm assuming with different actors guys if we're gonna be real if we're gonna be honest was Until Dawn even really that good to be having, like, a whole remake and then, like, a whole movie? And I feel like what was really the thing that stood out with Until Dawn was the choice-based mechanic. So if we're going into a movie, are you just going to follow, like, the right choices? Or it's like, what are we, what are we doing here? Are you going to make maybe change the whole thing? And Berlin's playthrough. What if they did? What if they start the movie and it's like until dawn and it's like inspired by the events from Berlizzi's choices and then the movie everyone dies and it's like literally just like it's one of the horror movies where everything just goes wrong. <laughs> it's one of the horror movies where literally the the killer wins and it's like like it's bad though. It's like not even redeemable. Like there's no there's no way you make a second one cuz like literally it's bad. Like it's that bad. <laughs> it's so bad that there's no way you can milk it again cuz everyone's dead. <laughs> everyone's dead, bro. Unless you get a whole new cast or something like that. I don't know. It was cool, bro. It was cool, bro. 